Hello everybody, El Bristow here. You are watching Elatopia Gaming. Today I have an interesting little puzzle game for you known as Mini Metro. The idea of this game is to build a metro system, uh, train stations that link together uh, and to control overcrowding on the train system. This is a, a pre-release as it says here on the screen. This is Alpha 7. Um, and a link to the developers and a download link will be in the description of this video. Uh, but I thought we'd just do a quick little playthrough so that you could see what this game's like. Uh, and hopefully you guys will be interested in supporting this guy in his development. So let's start a new game. And we start off with three stations, circle, square and triangle. And the idea is this square, this square here wants to go from circle to square. So we build a train line so that the train can do that. This guy wants to get from square to triangle, so we build a station, uh, build a track so that he can do that. We're allowed to build up to three tracks at first, and people can change track at stations and move around. Um, here we've got another station popped up, so we need to build another, another track to that. We can join the two together, building a tunnel under the river. And this tunnel will slow down our train, as you can see there, but will mean that we can connect the stations together and the idea of this is obviously to get your people from each of the stations to the destinations before they get the ump and kick up a fuss and what happens is when you get too busy or you take too long to develop to deliver your passengers to their destination you get a little a little timer that pops up around the station and you will see that uh, the people have got the ump and if the timer runs out you lose the game, that's game over. Um, now we have an issue here, we've had a new station pop up, they're getting annoyed already so I'm going to have to do something like that which is a little bit inefficient but uh, there we go, it does connect the station up. Uh, we have to join that one now. Uh, so this yellow train is getting to have quite a long track to travel on. Um, but you'll see that as the game goes through it slowly zooms out to reveal more of the map as more and more stations appear. You can kind of see that now if you look carefully. You'll see that the, uh, the right hand side of the river has come into the screen um, and that obviously allows for the map to get bigger and bigger. This thing gets really really busy and uh, it gets quite hectic as the game goes along. Now this new station has popped up here. I want to take this red one through but obviously it cuts through the river which adds a tunnel which slows the train down. Aha! And here we go. At the end of each week you get the opportunity to build either a new line or a new train upgrade. Sometimes it offers you different upgrades at the end of each week. For example it might give you the opportunity to uh, well in the old alpha it gave you the opportunity to have an extra tunnel but now tunnels are not in limited supply um, so I'm not sure how that uh, mechanic works now but here we go these are the options we have we can have a new line or we can have a train upgrade train upgrade meaning that it gets two carriages and I think a little bit faster yeah booster train speed and capacity or we can have an extra line I think we will go with a new line at the moment. We don't need a new line at the moment but it will be nice to know that we can have one should we need it. Um, for example we might want to build a line that goes along the bottom of here to join that up or something like that. Um, this line here is pretty good. You can see we've got one of each station on it. This one here we've got one of each station on it. This line doesn't have a square station on it but that's not the end of the world because they can deliver anyone trying to get to square to here and then that'll take them across like that. Ah, but we've got a new kind of station that's just popped up here. So what we will do I think is move this line so it goes to that station first and then, whoops, nope, then it will hook, no, I want this one, that's it. Then it will hook round down to that station down there. There we go. Oh, and another new station has popped up up here now. Uh, I think we will drag the blue one to go up to that. Um, as you can see, you can modify your lines. You can remove them all together if you like. Um, but the... Uh, Obviously the passengers on the stations on those lines will get delayed and if you've got a, a busy line 
that could lead to you losing the game so you have to be a little bit careful so I'm just going to play through this and see how far we can get how many points we can build up you can see our points down here in the right hand corner and we have another station that's popped up here so I think it is time for us to start having a look at here we go another line that does something like that and perhaps get rid of this bit of the blue line whoops that wasn't what I meant to do that was meant to go to there there we go and there we go so we've got four lines running four trains running and that will keep these customers happier hopefully and we'll just let this tick by Oh, and another station has popped up another circle station which is a bit of a pain um, we'll go like that I think we're coming to the end of the week now here we go so we have an option for another train upgrade or another line so I think the yellow line is getting quite long now so we are going to go for a train upgrade on this occasion and what happens is we get a little pop-up window here with our upgrades in we can't build any more lines but we have a green station upgrade, a uh, train upgrade rather, so we're going to drag that to there and we'll see an extra carriage pops up and that train can now add twice as many passengers to it and that will hopefully build, uh, hopefully help us cope with the overcrowding on that line. Oh and a new station and a new type of station has popped up down here, we have this plus now so I think the dark blue line can head round to that one and you can see very very quickly the game starts to get pretty hectic we have another triangle station that's popped up here I think the yellow line can cover that one so like we've got over here we've got a passenger who wants to get to plus so this yellow train has to get all the way over here grab them bring them all the way over here aha here we go a timer has popped up now so hopefully this yellow one will get here and pick these guys up here we go we've taken those and you see the timer slowly ticks back down these guys are getting unhappy now so the yellow train's got to get over there to those before that timer runs out we're running out of time come on yellow train come on yellow train pick them up pick them up pick them up pick them up yeah we got them good 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 right and we have another yellow station that's popped up over here um, I think yeah, we we'll have to do the light blue one I think uh, that means that one goes through two tunnels now which is not great and these guys on the yellow line are getting unhappy again this is not good I think this could be the end of our game oh no we're okay the dark blue one saved us there it was people trying to get to the plus station that were unhappy so we saved that one that was a bit of a close call oh and another station's popped up a square station now so we've got to head up here hopefully we'll get a new line I think at the end of this week and we'll have a bit of a reorganization here we go so oh a station upgrade so we can increase the station's capacity or we can build an extra line now station capacity can I move oh ah, I see right station capacity might be good because this guy is starting to get quite busy so we could perhaps increase the capacity of this station and that will hopefully mean that people on this station will be a bit more patient or we could do it to one of the outlying stations so that they are uh, less inclined to get annoyed or we could have an extra line to add an extra train onto the system I think actually the station upgrade is probably good this one is getting quite busy all the time this one is getting busy all the time I think this one is probably the best bet for us so if we go for a station upgrade and we'll drag that into there there we go so that's now a higher capacity station and I'm gonna drag this red line whoops Ah, no, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm going to drag this red line. No, there we go. Right, drag the red line to there, to our new higher capacity station. And hopefully that will help with the rush as well. Um, we've got some guys down here. Yeah, these are starting to get annoyed. They're trying to get all the way over here. Hopefully this guy can pick those up on this run through. 
Has he got them? Yeah, he's got them. The triangle guys seem okay for the moment, although they've been left behind and they only need to get from there to there. Why don't they just get out and walk? Um, oh, we've got a new station popped up. Uh, oh, that's a nasty location for a station. Uh, we could do with an extra line, but we have no more lines available. Uh, how are we going to deal with that? I think we're going to have to take the red line away from there and up like that, something like that. That's not great, but uh, that's about as good as we can do with that one, I think. And another station has popped up too. Circle station. Oh, game over. What happened? Ah, oh, it was this station down here. We didn't see that one. So these guys got the ump, and I think it was these triangle guys that we uh, saw before. This line just was not efficient enough. They got the ump, and they caused a riot and it brought down our entire train network because of course that's what happens so there you go that's that's a playthrough of mini metro and uh, as I say a link will be in the description so that you guys can go and take a look uh, download a copy of this for yourself this is alpha 7 please do support these guys vote them up on steam I'm gonna go and do that now I've got 359 points let me know how well you guys do uh, comment and in the uh, comment on this video to let me know your high scores don't forget to like and subscribe to get notifications when our next video goes live so I have been El Bristo thanks for watching guys and I will see you next time see you later